Good morning, my name is David Shenz. I'm the Vice President for Operations at ERP Suites. I'm really excited to be joined by Sean Mead, who is our Head of Security. Good morning, David. It's really good to be here. Perfect. So we're going to talk a little bit about email security today. We've been, both been in the space for a while, and we've seen that email security has really evolved. You know, probably 15 years ago, we used to think of email security as really how do I filter out spam? How has kind of the threat landscape in email changed over these last uh, probably five, 10 years? Oh, it's been very dramatic, David. Uh, the, when we look at how email has changed, like you said, we started with just having to worry about spam because you didn't want everyone's mailboxes filling up or anything like that. And the old style of trying to throw out communications and, and odd characters and things of that nature, it was easy to, easy to find stuff that shouldn't be in there. But now we have very good bad actors to mix, uh, mix terms there. They know how to slightly change URLs and slightly change email addresses. So they start fooling us right out of the gate. They are completely unscrupulous. So with that being the case, they have no problem trying to play off of, uh, let's go with individuals first, uh, to play off of people's sympathies. So as you approach different points, let's say a holiday such as Christmas or Hanukkah or any of the others where you want to give, where there's a big stress on giving to people with less, well, they will actually play off of that and talk about being with charities and things of that nature that are out there. Now, if they are willing to do that to individuals where they don't know if you really do have a lot of money, imagine how much better they get at their attempts to fool us when it comes to a business that they know has deep pockets. So it looks like customers, it looks like vendors, it looks like our friends and family even. Uh, if they get a hold of an address book, which is very easy, especially in the personal realm, you can get company names, company addresses as far as email, and uh, the play off of that is, is tremendous. The little characters that can be changed, uh, one of the things that they like doing the best is a URL that is slightly off as far as a link that is in an email thread. It can be one letter that is transposed because a lot of times our brains will automatically put that in the correct order and we won't even realize it unless we're really studying on that URL. So it, it has gotten so much more sophisticated in this day and age.